Hello guys, we're back with another episode of Monday Night Raw, back with a my career. And you guys can see Nia Jax is saying how she's sick of the champion, sick of Raw. And uh, basically kind of calling out Fuller Webb because he's disrespecting him. Now, if all the men in the men's division know that is a bad idea. You do not mess around with Fuller Webb and this is exactly why. Fuller Webb does not care who you are. He will come and prove his worth. I think he's about to go for that slingshot X Factor. Yes, he is. Hello, we are back after the commercial break. We have news that there was somebody masked in the backstage walking with a steel chair. So we got backstage to get some cameras on it. And now look at this. What? What is he looking to do? He's walking backstage with a chair. What is he? What are he, this person's intentions? And and who are they? That that's my biggest question. Who are they? Walking into the locker room now. He walks in. Oh, and Naomi's in there. Oh no! I think I know what's about to happen. Lights out. Oh, chair shot to Naomi. And look at this. Hello guys, we are back on Raw after the commercial break where Tommaso Champa is set to do battle with a mystery opponent here tonight. And guys, we are back after the, the break and you guys saw match. exactly Making what happened. You guys saw Romeo how Naomi had just got attacked by a math attacker Thomas with a steel Bo chair. chair. Now, Tommaso Ciampa, he may have been the one to do it. Nobody knows who did it. But, oh my goodness, no, if somebody with a steel chair, is this who I think it is? Is this who I think it is? He has the steel chair in hand. Oh, right to the back. And it is the mass attacker. The same steel chair that they use to attack Naomi. We are going at it at Muscle Champa attacking him. Oh my goodness guys. This oh I did not expect this. Tomoso Champa didn't even get time to take off his jacket or anything. He's just getting attacked. The referee needs to stop this match immediately. Tommaso Ciampa is being assaulted. He's just getting thrown around. I think the mass attacker is looking to throw him into the ring. Yes, he is. And now the mass attacker going to the ring. He's going to put the chair into the corner. Tommaso Ciampa is about to get up. But he's about to be in for a rude awakening. As he gets thrown to the outside of the ring. I thought he was about to get thrown into the chair there. Oh, and a DDT. And now the mass attacker is just taunting. Look at the fans. And now look at Tommaso Ciampa. He's about to be getting that work. Look at that jumping poison runner. Oh my goodness. Tommaso Ciampa is getting manhandled right there. You can see the feet connect. And the guy's serious question. Who do you think the mass attacker is? Who do you think this guy or girl is? They just come out of nowhere, start attacking people. Literally, look at that, the head of Tommaso Ciampa and a drop kick. Tommaso Ciampa has to roll out of the ring. Tommaso Ciampa just turning around. Maybe he wants to leave. Now the mass attack is coming out. He's gonna stare. Oh my goodness, staring. Oh, but a punch. And now, look at this, Tommaso Ciampa. He caught the mass attacker off guard going to the top rope here oh no we just get caught slipping and Tommaso Ciampa must attack a go for something oh Tommaso Ciampa just got out of the ring but the master attack is gonna be there now going for something oh you see the end of Guri oh my goodness Tommaso Ciampa is looking to end it oh no the master attack back up to his feet now oh look at this now the master attack he could be going for something. He's calling for Tommaso Ciampa to get up to his feet. And it could be near. Oh my goodness. What What the hell? We've never seen that maneuver ever done before in 
W A. Now, Masaka. He's he's looking to go for something. Is it gonna connect? Yes, it is. Oh no, guys! I think we may have a clue who the master attacker is. Oh, and Tommaso Champa kicks out. We have a clue who the master attacker is, but guys, fans. Uh, uh, fans and I can see social media they're saying they think this map the attacker may be full web but guys this there is also a man who was masked a member of the brainwash generation should I say leader of the brainwash generation who does moves exactly like that if you guys remember not so long ago around two years ago Phoenix Nitro former WWE and Universal Champion wore a mask and he wore an um, uh, outfit a bit like that and he just he attacked just innocent people and he formed the brainwash generation do you guys really think that phoenix nitro could be the one behind this we haven't seen phoenix nitro in a long long time do you guys think that phoenix nitro could be behind this oh my goodness tomaso champa lands on his knees look at this tomaso champa gets thrown into the ring look at this saying that he's at a break let's go on a super kick right to tomaso champa the end is near for champa and I if this connects it could be over. I think it is over. Master Tucker not going for the pinball. Oh no. Going in the corner. What could he be looking for? Oh and the drop kick connects. Now gonna put Muscle Champa in the corner. What is he about to go for? The punches. He's trying to cause punishment, but oh no, he gets caught slipping. Look at this. Tommaso Ciampa brings him to the top rope. What is he looking to do? I think we're about to see a, a superplex. And we do. Tommaso Ciampa is dazed, but he has to get up to his feet. Calling for it. Calling for the finish. And it could be the math attack of the fairy tale ending oh my goodness what is he looking for he's already attacked the math attacker time and time again elbow off the top rope and now he wants the math attacker he's not done with him calling for it oh my goodness Look at this, he's going for something, he's getting fired up, but no, the master attacker finishes him with that rock bottom and looks bad for Champa here tonight. Champa does not know what to do. He could have put the master attacker away. Look at these repeated strikes, just assaulting to muscle Champa. Oh my goodness. And I think he is looking to finally break to muscle champ of a super kick to the face and what is he looking for he's calling to muscle champa back to his feet and yes he connects with that death valley driver oh my gosh to muscle champa what are you going to do Look at this. Tomoso Champa is just trying to crawl. But Mass Attacker not having it. Oh no. Look at that Lariat that connects right to Tomoso Champa. Flips him in half. Now look at this. Just turning it to the head. Kicks the head of Tomoso Champa. I'm gonna pin him if he looks like this. This is embarrassing for Champa. One, two, three. Oh my goodness. He lost like that. This is not good for Tommaso Champa. 
I think Jumper might be out to get some revenge. And the masked attacker gets the win against the muscle Jumper. Oh, what is he looking for here? Oh no, he's getting out the ladder. Oh no, not to Tomato Champa's face. Now, what's he doing? Puts down the ladder. And I think he could be looking to end Champa's career. 2020 shit, it kind of soft line. My side is so far away and behind. Slow it down and I promise I'll get mine. Get in a grip on time, eye for an eye. Need that Agamotto vision, I'm like that, I'm sorry.